Well, hello there, my friends. This is Donkey Freckle, also known as Dr. Kill Geo, bringing you another how to find certain shit in Bloodborne. And today, we're going to be finding the Black Messenger hat and the wooden shield, but mostly the Black Messenger hat. And to obtain this item, you must have killed the Blood Starved Beast located in Old Yarnum. And after you kill this beast, you will open up a new location called the Healing Church Workshop, which is located to the right of the Cathedral Ward. And also worth mentioning, I'm going to split this video into two different routes. The first route is the fastest route, but it has the shortcut unlocked. If you do not have the shortcut unlocked, don't worry. In the longer route, I will show you how to reach the item and also unlock the shortcut. Actually, I'll just mention it so that you could do it yourself. So let's not waste any more time, guys. Let's get straight to it. Let's do it. Alright my friends, for the fast route, it's really straightforward, like, there's no tricks to it really. When you go up the stairs and you see those two watchmen, whatever they're called, they're gonna point at you and go like, <laughs> and you know, while they're doing that, you can just go behind them and just pick up the wooden shield that's on the floor here. You don't need to kill the blister beast for that. They go inside and go up the ladder, the ladder to the right, and then just follow what I do and you'll have your item right, right there and there. Alright, for the long route specifically, it's not really hard, you just gotta be always on the move. Make sure that you have blood vials because you are gonna be taking a bit of fall damage. Not that much, but, you know, just bring blood vials. It's better to be safe than sorry. So, you're gonna see all the platforms I'm gonna drop onto. I try to do that uh, for minimal damage, to take minimal fall damage. So just follow what I do. Once we get to the alley, you're gonna make a left, which my character's gonna take a while to get to that point. But once he gets there, I'm sorry, she gets there, you're gonna go make a left. And I kinda had trouble, not really trouble, but I ran into two enemies, and I don't remember if the platform or the elevator, whatever you wanna call it, I don't know if it was already down, like when you first see it, your first time seeing it, if you have to call the lever to go up the platform. If not, uh, just kill the two enemies that I think the dog completely ignored me after that first attempt to hit me, and then you're pretty good to go. Here's the shortcut that I was talking about, if you didn't see the fast route, just pull that lever and you'll open the shortcut and you will never have to run the same route again. Hallelujah. Holla frickin' looyer. That's pretty much it for the long route, my friends. I hope you enjoyed. Now I'm going to show you exactly how to put this on your messengers, so stay tuned for that. Through space and time we have traveled back to the hunter's dream, and now I just go up these steps and go through this somewhat hidden path, at least to me it would look hidden, and you will see your messengers. Just talk to them. Well, just. 
bring up the the inventory and you should see the black messenger hat option put it on them look at them they look ugly as hell but they're still adorable in an ugly way anyways ding a hang a ling a ding we have reached the end of this video I would like to thank you guys for watching honestly it means a lot to me that you have chose my video or chosen to watch my video over the thousands of other videos trying to show you how to do this crap and I know that you guys have more valuable things to do than watch this video so again thank you for watching and I will bring you more how to find certain shit and blah blah real soon take care my friends honestly take care